like that you do want to I watch think I'm that. going to be learning the Russian have, language has to deal well. with the churches here the Russian Orthodox churches are gorgeous hey hello hi my amazing subscribers where are my Russian subscribers where we have the likes of shaman Diana Akundinova and the likes the rest of them okay but in today's video I am not here with a music video I am here to react to Walter's world the link to that video is going to be in my description box I am going to be reacting to the don't of visiting Russia previously I have done videos of don't of visiting Poland and some other other amazing video here and there you can do well to check them out and down there I have a membership button yes besties I have a membership button you can as well join my membership where I have any amazing subscribers I have Poland hub I have Putri Ariani lovers please click on that join button to join my membership or click on the thanks button to support my channel and what I do if you like my content okay so besties I would not want to bore you guys with so many talks I would like us to dive right into this particular video at the Hermitage in mm. St. Petersburg, Russia. And today what we have for you are some of the don'ts about visiting Russia. And before I get in my list of the don'ts, mm. one thing I really have to say is don't prejudge Russia. Whatever you hear in the news and all these kind of stuff, there's so many things out there saying bad stuff about Russia. And yeah, stuff like do that. your own it's research. Yeah, visit, don't, so don't prejudge be Russia. By that's very very yourself. important and i want to start off with that okay now my real don't list is going to start with number one don't even think Ooh. about trying to come to visit russia don't try to enter visa. russia without a visa who enters a country without a visa, visa in the As first I look at the numbers of our views most of you come from places that need a visa okay. and it does take a long okay. time okay so make sure you're planning beforehand Yes, there is a visa-free mm. cruise you can do to stop in St. Petersburg for less than 72 Russia hours. Russia is beautiful. But if you want to go and explore like, this beautiful country beautiful. where there's Moscow or going on a, the Volga okay. River and stuff like okay. that, you do have to get a visa. So don't skip that. you got to plan for it ahead of time. Mm. And with that, don't Ooh, forget to I register did not visa know when that. you do get to Russia. Don't yeah. forget to we'll register your you. visa you before you visit like or you when you visit Russia. So after getting the visa, I guess we have to register it when we visit Russia. visa all that kind of stuff you want to have that second don't Ooh. i have you do not lose don't, don't lose, lose your, your immigration card, card. wow to russia they're going to give you like an immigration card they'll fill out you need that when you leave if you don't have that it can cause some trouble mm. so make sure you don't forget it don't think oh it's just a piece of paper yes whatever. walter don't, don't forget, forget it, it okay? okay my next don't for you is don't forget your rubles okay ruble is the currency here in russia and that's what you're going to pay with but you can pay with card no problem in places like St. Petersburg and Moscow. But if you're gonna be traveling Russia, cash is more king here, and you're gonna need rubles to pay. Sometimes St. Petersburg's and stuff, you can pay with euros or dollars here and there, but in general, it's rubles, and you need to have them to pay okay. because not a lot of places will take credit cards. So just a heads up for that one. And with that, don't expect Are this to you be a serious? cheap trip. You said Russia don't expect it to be a the visas, cheap the hotels, trip. Restaurants, stuff that like means that. Russia is actually really very expensive to visit. Here. <laughs> kind of going along wow. with that is, don't get upset if you see two different prices and you as the traveler have to pay a higher oh, are you price kidding because me? some museums so and they have like two have prices two set prices one for locals and one for oh foreigners my God. so don't get upset by it but just realize that sometimes hmm. you are going to pay more and don't I just have to pause this here like so is Walter now telling us that please guys correct me if i'm wrong but according to Walter's word he said there are different prices when you visit certain places there are prices for locals and prices for foreigners so me as a foreigner if i go to russia there to maybe i visit a particular restaurant there's a different amount i am to pay as a foreigner and a different amount a local should pay but that's very wrong to me i don't know why they place that law that way because i feel both locals and foreigners should pay the same amount when it comes to restaurants hotels and stuff like that let me know if water is actually correct in the comment section try to weasel your way out of it because they know if you're a local or not my sixth don't for you is don't mess with the cops or mm. any kind of the government officials when you are here. When you go through, make sure you have your information, all your stuff for the border control. And don't stare at the cops. Don't take pictures of the cops. Okay, don't ask them okay, things because okay, they have to help okay. you. And sometimes I've been shut down by cops who are here before. You don't want to give them a reason to ask for your documents and stuff like that, okay? So just don't mess with the police when you are here. Now, my next don't for you for here in Russia is don't let down your guard. Look. 
Moscow and mm. St. Petersburg are probably the two places you're really going to visit a lot. And there are pickpockets here. There's people trying to rip you off, all kinds of stuff. You do want to pay attention. So don't like, don't leave your stuff on the back of your seat if you're at a cafe. You know, do put the stuff between your legs. Always be paying attention because mm. you don't know if you're on the metro. Someone might be trying to pick your pocket and things like that. You do want to watch out for that. Now the next don't I have for you has to deal with the churches here. The Russian Orthodox churches are gorgeous from the outside and amazing from the inside. And my don't with that is don't skip the churches okay a lot of people think oh i'll just it's churches whatever man coming to the russian orthodox russian churches with the icons churchy. the gold and the silver and everything it just blows your mind wow. so we have St. Basil's Russia, or, the, or the spilled blood church Which here nice. there's so many amazing churches throughout the country don't skip those but also don't wear a hat when you're there but if you are a woman do cover your head Ooh. because it's an orthodox country they're conservative and so you want to show respect for that now my next don't for you when you are here is if you're going to bring money, like I talked about, you need to get rubles, is don't bring banged up US dollars or Ooh. euros. You need to have the crisp, clean kind so you'll exchange them, otherwise they won't accept them. My tenth thing for you is don't assume the Russians are cold-hearted kind of people. Yes, the service is kind don't of think bad Russian when you are people here, but if you get to know Russians, oh. they really warm up to you. I mean, I can't tell you how many times babushkas have taken me in and made me their cabbage rolls and people have shown me around. Just by speaking mm. a little bit of Russian can go a long way, okay? So don't be scared of that language as well. I Learn think I'm going to be learning really Russian language as well. And then I guess something with the people, they have a lot of these little tiny things like don't shake hands over the threshold. Don't give flowers in even numbers just so, you know, makes things a little bit better. Another don't I have for you is don't sp speak bad about Russia, the politicians, well, the country, very, the culture, very the food, important. things don't like that. Don't speak bad about Russia well. or their politics. Even here in Nigeria, we practice we'll that with ours, so Just don't get involved with those kind of things. And one of the things my Russian friends always made sure they do, and now I realize it is, you don't leave empty bottles on top of the table you've been drinking, you put it on the floor. I never really realized it until I started noticing it again and read it a few places, but it is really true. Anyway, those are just 10 or 11 quick little don'ts of visiting Russia. If you want to learn more, 10 things that'll shock you about Russia, things you should know before you come here, check us on our website at waltersworld.com. We're also on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and we really appreciate your likes, subscriptions, and bye from Russia. Oh my God. One reason I love watching these videos is the fact that I get enlightened. I learn a lot. Like currently, I am. I don't think I can visit Russia and make a mistake because Walter's World just gave a full detail, a well detailed video on the don't of, of Russia. Things you should not do when you visit Russia. And this is indeed amazing. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Like me, I learned a lot. I learned a lot. And I feel like Russia should be in my list of countries I would love to visit. Would you love to see me in Russia? leave it in the comment section I, mean, I want to visit poland and as well considering adding russia to list of countries i would love to visit it mentioned things like visiting their orthodox churches mentioned things like um not bad mouthing their politicians politics and all those stuff which is very very important not only in russia but even in my country in africa in other countries do not bad mouth their politicians because you are not in the position to do so all right when it's time to vote you vote for who you want to vote for okay so that's my own opinion about that we've come to the end of this amazing video let me know what you think in the comment section you can add more don'ts 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 of russia in the comment section if you like what you see make sure you subscribe before leaving like my video turn on your bell icon so whenever i upload a new video you would be the first to know so besties i'll see you all in another amazing reaction video bye for now